everyone. Welcome back to the Extra Life United Minecraft build competition. Uh, we have our next build team leader lined up. We have All Tribe with us. Hello. It's me, Hello. the next team guy. <laughs> Do you have a team name for your build team? Uh, yeah, we're Dog Pond 12. <laughs> okay. Dog Pond 12. <laughs> <laughs> Do you have and, an and issue with dog pot? Oh, I'm on the stream. Hey, I can see myself behind. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> yeah, because you're actually at the event now, right? The last I, two I remotes. Have, so. I'm in Orlando at the Extra Life Unlimited event in person. Very cool. Well, I guess I'm let's, ready to show uh, off my awesome build. So here we are. Uh, where do I? So I've started in this lighthouse that one of our uh, our builders. <laughs> Harmon has uh, has built. We built a lighthouse, a beautiful logo out there, and generally one of the things I like doing during these events is letting the people choose their own. Uh, we'll say destiny, so I sound smarter. Um, <laughs> and so you know, I feel like you know when we're talking about change and all of that, you know, we get to take control and let us change our world. So we have a lot of stuff to cover. <laughs> um, oh wow. So, yeah, and there's a lot of cool things. So here we have somebody who's built a giant wizard's tower and this dragon in the middle of here with all these little cute little floating lamps. That's um, amazing. It's so cool. It is, it's actually, it's wow. really cool. Inside this tower that's built by Drago and Paper, they have put this little spell book in this infinite uh, glass mirror uh, illusion. Which that looks so like cool. fog down there. It does. It does look like fog, <laughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> it, I've only seen it like twice in my life, so I'm just blown away by it every time I've seen it. Uh, over here, dedicated to Bruce Green, who is who is on our list of our donators, specifically for swearing. Uh, <laughs> we have uh, a dedicated a water park to him with, uh, with something never before seen in life, the, uh, the beautiful vertical lazy river. Which has Ooh. never been seen before ever. I don't know why we haven't built. You've got to go in it. You have to. Oh, go we in have it. to go in it. Yeah. Okay, I'll go. I'll go. Here we go. This is gonna. This is gonna go viral. <laughs> Holy! <laughs> That's crazy. Oh my! And and now I have to find my. You know, lazy rivers are always so hard to get out of. That's why I get stuck in them. <laughs> <laughs> and I don't move in them either. So there's all sorts of these like little water parks we built. There's a little cute little little beach here for you to hang out in, because you know Orlando is specifically where we're. At. There's is this just a normal lazy river? This is new to me. <laughs> a second, a classic. Over here Oof. we have a. We can. Somebody's already dunked him. What the. <laughs> so we built Aww. a dunk tank. I I try and dunk him, but apparently, you know, he's been pre-dunked. <laughs> uh, his... It's going okay. well. <laughs> this is going well. Uh... <laughs> <laughs> Anyways, we have uh, a beautiful mushroom that's been built. Uh, last year, we had another kind of mushroom. Unfortunately, you guys weren't there, so you uh, you didn't see the first mushroom. This is mushroom V two. Um, we have What's a different about this one? Uh, I think the last one was red. Okay. <laughs> uh, we have a beautiful little, wow, a beautiful little line <laughs> of moving. Uh, <laughs> we have a beautiful little shopping center for the people to come and buy their goods. Uh, we have a, a little viewing hall of all of these different kinds of pixel arts that people have built uh, for things in my community. Uh, we have a little petting zoo, which that's that's so nice. I, some of these are endangered. Hmm. I don't know if they should be here. We have a, a froggy <laughs> chair from Animal Crossing. Um, I don't know why. There's a Pizza Hut over there. <laughs> yeah. I'll be honest. <laughs> Get that part. Uh, over here, someone has built the... Uh, not someone. Uh, Master Renegade 1 has built this giant golden uh, galleon. Uh, which is absolutely just so gorgeous yeah. this little like yeah, dark it's tunnel lovely, yeah. it's like a dark tunnel but at the end of the Even dark the is like a it's like a light you know ah okay it's nice so clever and then uh someone named nasty 289 had built this this little redstone uh 
this little redstone door, this little redstone hobble where you can go in here. Hold on. Uh, just, uh, there Ooh. we go. A working contraption? Yeah. With this <gasps> giant piston door. Oh, <laughs> wow. Wow. And then there's this little beautiful room with the uh, the prompt, though. When we change kids' health, we unlock a possibility of future. Uh, here we have, you know, some people playing sports. We got some people at school helping people. They get to live a happy life, and they get to hang out, which is so cool. This is a great room. I I thought the parrots were somebody whistling at me in real <laughs> life. I was <laughs> terrified, I'll be what honest. What does that sign say? Uh, <laughs> Do not so press... Twice in a row. Twice in a row. In a row. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh. oh you okay? <laughs> so I actually pressed it twice in a row, and it broke, so now it's a sign. Yeah. <laughs> uh, we have more little ships that people built. Um, what else is there? I'm trying to remember. I think that's mainly the biggest things. There's all sorts of things all over. There's like this is like a Gundam that somebody built. There's another Gundam behind them. Somebody built mm -hmm. a scale replica of Dreamland from Super Smash Brothers '64. <laughs> <laughs> oh, and there's the house from Up. <laughs> where right? did that come yeah. from? Yeah, yeah. Where, it, I never where saw did that it come one from? I don't. Where did How Up live? I think he lived in Florida. I think. Yeah. <laughs> uh, what does it say? He, what does, what it, does say it say? Yeah. That's a great question. Oh, it's who built it? The willingly ah, okay. Peru Milo Otis got the paper. Nice. So it's the it's the building crew. Uh, and then all of these little blimps around the map, they actually all uh, work. So you could go here and you can teleport and you can see ah. different views of everywhere and there's like a little hub. So you can see like here's the here's the map. That somebody had oh. built oh, yeah. in <laughs> nice, order to get it all to work. Mm -hmm. uh, and then there's the the giant uh, miracle, the the miracle logo. All right. Uh, and yeah, that's uh, that's my world. That's our world that our community had built. <laughs> I love the tower on your left here. This tower, so cool. The yeah. dragon, so crazy. It's really neat. What's the big, what's the big um, 2D art in the background? That I think that is Lucina from Fire Emblem. What does she stand for? I don't. <laughs> <laughs> okay, all right. <laughs> I imagine she probably has some deep story. I yeah. Oh, cool. Yeah, and then wow. there's the giant yeah. extra life logo. And that concludes the, the beautiful tour of our beautiful little land. Very it's lovely. It kind, it kind of reminds me of Alice in Wonderland. It's very random, things happening everywhere. Well, <laughs> like, that's kind of like a child's that's mind. Kind of like, uh, that's kind of like how I love to roll. It's just random everything, chaos. Uh, <laughs> I find some of the beauty in collecting such a large amount of people to build things is to just let them run free. And every time you run around, you get a... Uh, a new thing to find, you know? Yeah. Yeah. There's pro I mean, I imagine there's probably an un underground section as well. Uh, <laughs> we yeah. just can't see. <laughs> Can you tell yeah. us a little bit about your uh, build community? Um, <clears throat> sorry, there's like tech issues next to me. Uh, My no build worries. community? I don't... Yeah, like any notable builders, if you want to name names, or if you just want to talk about how they I come together. I think I named them. To I'd like to yourself. shout out certainly uh, Harmon, uh, Nasty Two Eight Nine, and Master Renegade One, which are the ones that started off building it uh, by themselves for the first couple days. Um, and then I'd also like to shout out like Paper, who like came up with this tower design and these mushrooms. Uh, they certainly did a lot to uh, help bring in this entire. Uh, like, to help bring out the entire world together, you know? I'm yeah. good at talking. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> no, it's cool. It, to... it looks like a fun, like, map to explore. Yeah, it I fun. have a question. Can uh -huh. you enter the up house? 
Yeah, it's it's actually got a uh, entire interior. That's what I want to see. <laughs> they actually. Yep. Okay, there's a sign even. Oh. Well, now I'm curious. Was that? <laughs> oh, music. Wow. It's the, it's the doorbell the, the theme. Yeah. yeah. So it has like an entire interior. There's like the the uh, the wires that hold all the balloons in the chimney. Mm -hmm. And then upstairs we have beds. It's in fully interior design. Which, if there's nice. one thing I know about Minecraft and buildings, that never happens. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that was why All Tina right. asked the question. That's I'm why sure, I'm asking. So. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Ah, she's checking what to go judge on. You should have made him go in the yeah. tower. That's the real, the real. Yeah. 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 Go in the tower. Go in the I tower. went in the tower. This is always good oh. to guess. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. that's why you you did go in the yeah, tower. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. How quick I was did all... I forget? Yeah. Really nice. All right. Is there anything awesome. else you'd like to add before no. we wrap up? All right. Cool. Thought I went after an entire replica of Disney World. <laughs> <laughs> Alrighty. Yeah. Well, thanks to Ultrive. We're going to go to a quick break here and we'll be back with the next build. Well, I hope you've enjoyed this video. And I quickly wanted to say one thing towards all of the team members of the All Drive team. Now, as you might have noticed, some of the clips are either from me, Master Renegade, or Harmonum. And this is because, for the first three days, um, if you don't know, the event only was four days long, uh, no one except us came online. And that's what I quickly wanted to address. Now, if you join Extra Life United, you do not just join to be on your favorite YouTubers or streamers team. You join to build and raise money for a good cause. Of course, it's a benefit that you can be on your favorite person's team, but that's not the main thing. And it can't be blamed on us. I mean, like, we've tried getting people to join. We messaged the team on Discord, we added them in case they didn't notice that the event started, and we even got some members to message back. Some asked what the theme for this year's event is, or some just asked if the event already really started. This showed that they acknowledged the event had started, but did they come online? No. I mean like, even all tribe didn't message often. In the whole four days, all we got was like four messages, each containing less than four words. Agreed, he was in an event for extra life, IRL, which means he couldn't come online often, but I could still see him being online on Discord every day. But there was no messages, no pre-planning, nothing. And funny enough, right when All Tribe joined on the last day, somehow everyone was able to find their join buttons. I mean, at least try to hide that you don't care about the event and only All Tribe. It's literally like they were sitting in front of their Minecraft screen, being like, wait, how do I join the server again? And right when all tribes joined, they were like, oh yeah, right, I have to take the IP, put it in the direct connect part, and then click join. How was no one able to do that before? And I mean, if you only want to join the event because you want to play with all tribe, just wait for him to stream. Most team leaders make the IP public when they join as well. And please do not register for the event. This is because the teams are made equal for fairness sake. I mean, imagine you have a team with 10 people and a team with 8 people. Of course, not a big difference, but still a difference. So they would take one person from 10 people team and put it on the 8 people team, so both have 9 members. So it's equal. But if you join the event, only planning to come online on the last day, or at least when ever the team lead joins, you're more AFK than online, which in turn makes the teams unequal again. And let's be honest, it pisses off the team members that do come online for the event. Now, I don't want to say that nothing happened on the last day. I mean, there were great builds. I mean, like, someone built the up house, there was a majestic tower build with dragon around it, really great builds. But still, I mean, if at least a few more members would have joined more frequently, the overall look would have been way better. 
and also to the members the theme of this year was when we change kids health we unlock a world of possibilities for the future did you all stick to the theme uh no not one bit i mean i built a room that was only unlocked with a paper named changing kids health and it literally opened a world of possibilities because in my build inside the hill you could see what kids might want to achieve or do when they get healthy again. Master Renegade built the dark tunnel but at the end was a ship and an amazing ship I do have to say and that represented the freedom that can come after a bad time. And I have to be honest considering all of the builds that were done those are the only two builds where I can honestly say they have the theme 100% in them. I mean Come on, it's not that hard. I hope you'll change that or better yourself in the next year. And maybe do do some things that I just said. And yeah. Anyways, great days definitely. But still a bit boring considering no one came online. So yeah, I still hope you've enjoyed this video. And yeah. I will see you on the next one. Goodbye.